The Lakers are about to have a crazy offseason, and it all starts on draft night. The Lakers have three tradable first-round picks. This year's 2024 17th pick, if the Pelicans don't take that, the 2029 pick, and the 2031 pick. And it's being reported that Rob Polinka will be aggressive in trading those picks. So, what could the Lakers get? Let's start off with Donovan Mitchell, because that... I don't think it's going to happen. I think it's very unlikely. It would have to take Dan Gilbert saying, LeBron, thank you so much for giving us a championship in 2016. Thank you so much for everything you've done for us. Here, take down with Mitchell. That's not going to happen. Mitchell is a playoff riser. The Lakers are going to get outbid. And even if they could trade for Mitchell, you would have to give up Reeves, Rui Hachimura, Gabe Vincent, JHS, and a bunch of picks. Probably all three of them. And if you're saying... Trade D'Lo, well, you can't. He has a player option for $18 million. He's unlikely to pick that up. D'Lo is probably going to walk for nothing. If you're saying sign and trade him, well, that's very tricky to do. I expect D'Lo to walk in free agency. Now, how about Trey Young? In my opinion, while Mitchell is the better player, I think Trey Young is a better fit on this team. Hot take. Look, just imagine a pick and roll with Anthony Davis and Trey Young. I think this move also makes sense for the future because LeBron is in retire in a couple years. That duo of AD and Trey Young will be their centerpiece moving forward. But unfortunately, you would have to trade Austin Reeves for this deal as well. Austin Reeves, Rui Hachimura, Gabe Vincent, probably two first round picks, maybe three. And keep in mind, the Hawks just got the first pick. They're likely to go into rebuild and trade Trey Young. But in order for this trade to work, the Lakers have to get more size and defense to help Trey Young out with the defensive end. Names like Bruce Brown, KCP, Alex Crusoe, but the Lakers cannot get those guys because they traded away all their assets to get Trey Young. So this trade is going to be a little more tricky. That leads me to my favorite option, DeJounte Murray. For DeJounte Murray, you could trade for him while keeping Austin Reeves. A package like Rui Hachimura, JHS, Gabe Vincent, and two picks. And you can use that other pick to get more pieces. Someone like Alex Crusoe. Just an example because that's... A miracle because the Bulls are very stubborn. With this move, the Lakers save a lot more money and are able to build up more depth, get more players like Royce O'Neal, Kelly Oubre Jr., Andre Drummond, Jonas Valanciunas, the list goes on. And DeJounte Murray is a two-way player. Yes, his defense has declined since he first came into the league, but he's still a great defender. And a backcourt pairing of DeJounte Murray and Austin Reeves sounds nice. With this trade, the Lakers could be a top five, top three defensive team in the NBA next year. You could have a starting unit of Austin Reeves, DeJounte Murray, Vanderbilt, LeBron, and AD. And the Lakers could still get more pieces after that. This trade is easily the best trade available out there for the Lakers. This will put them at a top five defensive team and easily a championship contender. So what trade would you want the Lakers to do? Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and like. Go Lakers!